Hi guys, I'm Nirita. In this video, I'm going to teach you some trick based on polynomial division. Okay. Uh, in our 10th standard, we normally used to study how to divide two polynomials and all. Now I'm going to tell you one trick uh, to easily do that uh, polynomial divisions. Okay. So the first question will be like 2x square plus 3x plus 1. Okay. Divided by x plus 2 will come. Okay. Uh, the first step what you have to do is uh, you, ha you have to write this write that question okay it's like um, uh, just uh, put this thing and what you have to do is here you, you just put this uh, dividend like x plus 2 okay and then uh, put one bar symbol then minus 2 opposite to this plus 2 is minus 2 okay in every problems we used to do the same suppose if you are having minus symbol means you have to convert that into plus symbol understood this would be your first step then second step would be like the coefficients 2 3 1 right so you have to write the coefficient like 2 3 1 understood you have to write the coefficients like 2 3 1 then what you have to do is the third step will be like uh, in every step okay in every problem you have to bring that starting term to down you have to bring the starting number to down and then what you have to do is that uh, minus 2 into 2 will give you what minus 4 this minus 2 and this uh, sorry this 2 and minus 2 will when you multiply those two things you will get minus 4 then you have to add 3 minus 4 will give you minus 1. Understood? Then take this minus 1 into minus 2. Minus 1 into minus 2 is 2. If you add you will get 3. Okay. So here the quotient. Here the quotient will be like this. That is 2x minus 1. And the remainder will be like 3. That's it. Okay. Actually what we have did is. We are just putting that uh, uh, lines and we are writing this x plus 2 and below that we are writing minus 2. Okay. For, and then you are uh, considering the coefficients alone. Okay. And then you are considering the coefficients alone. So you are getting like this and then you are taking the first digit downwards. Then that number into that um, divisor will give you what? minus 4 that you have to put it here then 3 minus 4 will give you minus 1 then take this minus 1 and a minus 2 if you multiply you will get 2 so 1 plus 2 will give you 3 that is what your remainder understood hope you understood we will see uh, another problem based on this okay yes my if you see this uh, problem the thing is what you have to do is you have to draw this line then x minus 1 it will convert into plus 1 right minus will minus 1 will convert into plus 1 then you have to take that coefficients like 4 minus 3 7 understood then what you have to do is um, key, uh, bring that first number as it is then multiply this 4 into 1 will give you 4 then 4 minus 3 will give you 1 then 1 into 1 will give you 1. Then 7 plus 1 will give you 8. Therefore, the quotient will be like 4x plus 1 and the remainder will be like 8. That's it. Hope you understood. Okay. Then we are going to see another problem. Okay. Which is 3x cube plus x square plus 2x plus 5 divided by x square plus 2x plus 1. So, here also what you have to do is draw this line. And then uh, put it like x square plus 2x plus 1. Okay. Put one division symbol. Here we are having plus 2. No? So you, you have to write it like minus 2. If you are having plus 1 means you have to write it like minus 1. Okay. This is your first step. Then you have to consider the coefficients like 3, 1, 2, 5. So 3, 1, 2, 5. Likewise you have to take. Yes. Then what you have to do is you have to. Uh, bring this first uh, number down. I told you already like you have to bring this first term down. Yeah, you will be getting like 3. Then what you have to do is 3 into minus 2 will give you minus 6. 3 into minus 2 will give you minus 6. Then 3 into minus 1 will give you minus 3. 3 into minus, uh, 3 into minus 1 will give you minus 3. 
then what you have to do is if you add these two numbers you will get what minus 5 if you add these two numbers you will get what minus 5 and then what you have to put is here you are having minus 5 minus 5 into minus 2 will give you 10 then minus 5 into minus 1 will give you 5 the thing is you have to start from the next term only okay um, suppose uh, if you are considering 3 no then you have to multiply that thing with this and you have to bring that uh, number to next understood so to the next column only likewise you have to put that's why i'm putting 10 here understood so minus 5 into minus 2 will give you 10 so i'm putting like that then you have to add everything 10 minus 3 will give you 7 7 plus 2 will give you 9 okay 5 plus 5 will give you 10 so here when you write the quotient no if you are writing the quotient means the quotient will be like 3x minus 5 and the remainder will be like 9x uh, plus 10 understood this is your quotient and this is your remainder okay now we are going to do another problem based on this is here what you have to do is you have to draw this line put like x plus 3 okay for x plus 3 you'll be writing like minus 3 and you have to write the coefficients like uh, 1 2 and 2 minus 3 2 is yes. then what you have to do is you have to bring this first term to down 1 then 1 into minus 3 will give you minus 3 okay so minus 3 plus 2 will give you what minus 1 understood then what you have to do is then what you have to do is take this thing minus 1 into minus 3 will give you what 3 right so you have to put this 3 here okay when you add you will get what minus 3 plus 3 will give you 0 right then what you can do is 0 into minus 3 will give you 0. If you add, you will get 2. Okay. Here, the quotient. Here, the quotient will be like 1 minus x is there, right? So, you have to take it like uh, x square minus x. It's like uh, what to say is um, if you are having x cube means the quotient will start by x square. Okay. 1 power uh, minus. Then the remainder will be like 2. Because you are not having anything right. So it will be like it will be like x square minus x and the remainder will be like 2. Understood? Then uh, we are going to see one, another problem which is uh, suppose if you are having a question like 3x square minus x cube minus 3x plus y divided by x minus 1 minus x square then what you have to do is you have to uh, you have to draw this okay and then first thing what you have to do is you have to arrange this thing this is x cube this is x square this is x this is y right according to this if you arrange you know you will get like minus 1 plus 3 minus 3 5 understood so i am keeping it like uh, x cube coefficient is minus 1 here x cube coefficient then x square coefficient is 3, then x coefficient, then constant coefficient, understood? Then here also I have to do like this. First thing is minus x square is minus x square minus, sorry, plus x minus 1 is there, right? So, I will be discussing this answer in next video. Thank you for watching.